Are you a dinosaur yet? Subscribe to become one now. Hello all dinosaurs! Today we have a huge box of Jurassic World dinosaurs, animals, and lots of prehistoric sea animals. So let's get started. First one right here, we have the new Amagosaurus. Doer attack. Press this button, the neck will move, and the other button will activate the tail. This is a really nice Amagosaurus. It didn't come with a code below, so I'm pretty disappointed. Alright, next up, let's take a look at the Albertosaurus right here. The new Albertosaurus, the battle damage Albertosaurus. Not exactly new, but relatively new. And of course, right here we have the Destroy and Devour Indominus Rex, which is definitely one of my most favorite figures. There are two buttons. The first button will activate the jaw, and if I press it enough, you can actually see a light coming through the neck. It's really nice. Next up, let's take a look at some other figures. We have the Baryonyx right over here. Baryonyx is known as the Heavy Claw. And here we have a sea animal. This is an alligator. Oh, it is actually a Nile Crocodile. I beg your pardon. Alright, let's move on. Here we definitely have a sea animal. This is actually a prehistoric sea animal. You guys able to guess the name of this creature right here? It is known as the Chronosaurus. It looks like a Mosasaurus. Okay, next up, what is this? What is this? This is actually a prehistoric fish. Are you guys able to tell me the name of this prehistoric fish? Alright, let me know down below. This is a huge armored prehistoric fish. Next up, we have another dinosaur right here, the Ankylosaurus Rorivor. This is actually a new one. If you press this button, the tail will move and it will produce a roar. Very nice, I love it. Next up, we have a tiger right here. Okay. And what about this? We have a horse. Beautiful horse. Let's take a look at the name of this horse, shall we? It is known as the Black Forest Horse. I love horses, they look so beautiful. Okay, next up, we have an ostrich. Alright, an ostrich is a bird which can't fly. Next up, we have a Mosasaurus, the real feel Mosasaurus. This is actually a prehistoric marine reptile. It is so huge. If you guys have seen the movie Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom, you would have seen it in action. It is so huge. Next up, we have a prehistoric flying reptile. This is known as a Pteranodon. We have more prehistoric beast right here. And this is actually a Plesiosaurus. Alright, this is actually a pretty rare figure. Next up, we have two Dimorphodons. One is a green one and one is a grey one. Prehistoric flying reptiles as well. Let's take a look at this. And this is actually a um, flying bird, flying animal. <laughs> Alright, this is a vulture. Next up, we have another prehistoric animal. Let's take a look at what it says. This is actually known as the Hydrotherosaurus. Yeah, it has a very long neck which allows it to feed on different um, fish. And here we have a Ramphorhynchus. If you take a look at the teeth, they are very interesting. Next up, we have a Proceratosaurus, a carnivorous dinosaur. This is actually Series 2 Proceratosaurus. Next up, we have a white lioness. Beautiful. Love it. Uh, and 
this, it's a white alligator. Yeah, it looks so good. And um, it's this Delta. Yes, I think so. A Velociraptor Delta. And here we have the latest Mononychus. Beautiful. It is a feathered dinosaur. I'm not too sure if this is a carnivorous dinosaur or a herbivore. It could be an omnivore, which means it fits on both plants and um, animals. It could be one, not too sure. And here we have a Spanish bull. Nice. What about this? Let's get the Spinosaurus out first. We have um, the Extreme Chomping Spinosaurus, which is so huge. Alright, it comes with a button. Press it. That will actually move the jaw. Okay, next up, let's see. Um, what about this? Tapi Jera, a prehistoric flying reptile. Let's bring it closer. And what about this? Another prehistoric flying reptile. The doer attack from um, Pteranodon it triggers the jaw, first button, and the other one, the wings. Next up, we have this Mazarus, a sauropod. It looks very cute. To me, it looks like a juvenile um, sauropod, a juvenile dinosaur, because it looks very small. Next up, we have a tiger, an orange tiger, love it. And what about this? Is this a Chronosaurus? Let's take a look. I think so. Yep, a Chronosaurus, a 2017 figure. Looks really good. And what about this? Another Proceratosaurus, but a, um, in a different color. Nice. Next up, um, let's take a look at this. Another prehistoric marine creature. Let's take a look at the name. It's written below. Plesiosuchus. Looks interesting. Okay, next up. You guys know this. Triceratops, the three horned face. It comes with a uh, dino damage wound right here. Triceratops. What is your most favorite Ceratops? Please let me know down below. And what is this? Let's take a look. This is actually a Coelocanth, which is similar to the previous one, a prehistoric sea animal. And right over here, we have another horse, a grey horse. And what is the name of this? Shire Horse, Horse Man. Alright. And over here, we have another prehistoric animal. It looks like a Chronosaurus to me. Let's take a look at the name. Not too sure. It could be a Mosasaurus from Bully Land. Next up. What about this? Is this an Elasmosaurus? Let's take a look. Yes, it is an Elasmosaurus. Another prehistoric marine creature. Let's move on. We have an animal right here. This is the snow leopard. Beautiful. It has thick fur covering its body to keep itself warm. And here we have a Diplodocus. I think so. Is this a Diplodocus? Yes, that's right. Beautiful. You can see the tiny little thorns on its body. And it has a, um, an elegant tail. Nice, long, elegant tail. And what about this? This is a beautiful lioness, an orange lioness. Let's move on. This is a beautiful um, Lyopleurodon. And over here we have a little... I'm not too sure what this is. It could be a Plesiosaurus. So cute. And this it's a Mosasaurus. It's a soft and squishy toy. It's beautiful. This is a beautiful figure. Okay, next up, let's see what do we have here. 
Protoceratops and Nidoceratops shin. And let's see. A huge one, a Giganotosaurus. A huge carnivore. Another one, T Rex. Beautiful T Rex. Tyrannosaurus Rex. What about this? This is a pretty cool sauropod. Let's take a look. Sautosaurus. Yeah, it has some armor on its body. Next up, what is this? Diablo Ceratops. A new figure. Beautiful Ceratopsian. Another um, prehistoric sea creature right here. Leoplorudon. What is this? We have an Ankylosaurus, or is this a um, Euplocephalus? I'm not too sure. Can you guys please help me out? It looks like an Ankylosaurus. Okay, we have another prehistoric um, sea animal. Let's take a look. Basilosaurus. This is actually a prehistoric whale. Yes, it is a prehistoric whale. Though it looks like a Mosasaurus. Um, I think we have a Silophysis right here. It is known as the Holo. I can't remember the nickname. Holo Bones? Holo One? And right over here we have a Tylosaurus. Another prehistoric animal. A white horse. Beautiful white horse. Let's take a look. Yep. And um, a Pachycephalosaurus. Beautiful. A mini Stegosaurus right here. This is actually made of um, like clay. It's pretty hard, but brittle. And um, a Mosasaurus. This is actually a vintage figure all the way back in. Okay, not exactly. <laughs> it is just 2014, so I beg your pardon. <laughs> it's not exactly a vintage figure. Alright, next up we have a Komodo dragon. This can be found in Indonesia. Yeah. And here we have a um Dracorex, I think. I can't remember the name of this figure. If you guys do know, please let me know down below. It could be a Dracorex. Ankylosaurus. Green one. A little figure right here, which I have no idea what this is. Looks like a Velociraptor. I mean, if you take a look at the sickle shaped claw, it does look like a Velociraptor. Up with a Brachiosaurus. And another Ramphorhynchus. If you take a look at the teeth, they are pointing outwards. It's very interesting in this figure. Okay, just gonna shift them over here. I think we have like 20 left. What is this? A Mosasaurus. Looks so cute. Um, what is this figure? Are you guys able to tell me what is the name of this? Um, Dinosuchers. Yes, that's right. Dinosuchers. Hippopotamus. Hippopotamus are actually pretty aggressive animals. Another prehistoric sea animal. Let's take a look. Dolly incurring cops. A very very uh, unusual and uh, very uncommon figure. Not many toy companies out there actually produces um, a figure for this species. Ceratosaurus! Yeah. The haunt lizard. And we have a prehistoric bird right here. Do you guys know the name of this prehistoric bird? 
let's take a look. It should be written right here. Micro Raptor. Yep, that's right. It has a beautiful long tail. A baby Spinosaurus right here. Yep, a baby Spinosaurus. And we have a prehistoric animal here. And this is actually known as um old oh deer. I can't remember. It looks like a prehistoric dog to me. But if you guys know the name, just drop a comment down below, alright? We have a Velociraptor right here, a fatted one. We have a couple of um, figures left. Okay, this is a Cytacosaurus. It looks like a parrot. A peacock. Over here. And this is actually a um, Tylosaurus. Interesting. Small. This could be um, an Archaeopteryx or a Microraptor, I'm not too sure. This should be a um, Silophysis. Yep, two Silophysis and a prehistoric flesh. fish, flying fish. Yep, so that's all. We have 80 different animals, sea animals and dinosaurs in this box. Hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I hope to see you soon in the next video, okay? Please give it a thumbs up, share this video and um, yeah, I'll see you guys really soon. Goodbye.